morning everyone um it's day three i think or four kind of in seoul um it's just coming out to midday i was feeling a little bit groggy after a few cocktails last night with my friend hannah so i just took it easy i didn't really get much sleep but i was still able to rest so i just took my time getting up this morning uh yesterday i got this hoodie that says ewa women's university which is super comfy and I really always wanted to get one of the like university sweatshirts but yeah I'm off into Myeongdong and on the hunt for breakfast I either might go to Isaac's Toast or just see like wherever's open but I definitely fancy something savoury so let's see what I can find <laughs> This is the best breakfast. So I got cheese, bacon, and potato. Um, so this one has a hash brown in it. <laughs> so egg, cheese, bacon, hash brown, unbuttered brioche. Mm -mm -mm. It's dirty, but it's good and it's cheap. Amore Songsu. So this actually isn't a store, it's I guess like a concept place where they show all of the different brands and products under Amore Pacific. So Amore Pacific is a conglomerate of a lot of different brands. So they have Mamons, they have uh, Etude House and uh, Sousu. So a lot of the main brands are under um, Amore Pacific, also Osaluk Tea House. So I do think that there is an Osaluk Cafe here as well. Feel like falling deeper, caught a nice night, no more shit. chicken from BHC on my way home and I'm gonna have an early night 
and I also got some of these little cake things. I've got red bean and walnut, but I actually got the custard version for a little dessert. I had to get some antihistamines as well, these allergy relief tablets because my hay fever since I've been here has been horrendous. My eyes are just so itchy and watery and yeah, I've just got such swelling by my eyes. So my friend Anna kindly helped me get some allergy relief pills. Okay, so we have chicken, cheese balls, radish. They gave me a Coke for free and Cajun fries. I have gloves to eat. I've got two pairs of chopsticks because I think she thought two people were eating. Season salt and BHC sauce. Cheese bowl. I think it has a bit of honey and it's like slightly sweet, but the butter's so good. I've had half the cheese balls, half the fries, and half the chicken, and I'm stuffed, so I'm gonna keep this and maybe I can have it as a snack or something tomorrow because it is a shame to waste this because it was so good. So I thought I'd share what I picked up in Amore Song Suit, which by the way is definitely worth visiting if you are into all things clean skincare. First of all, very random because I spent so much, I got a free pair of socks but they're very cute. Um, they also had um, a kind of sample section. So with your ticket, entry was 3,000 won, which was obviously really cheap. It's about a pound 50. You got um, five different types of samples. So I chose a hair care range, the Amore Pacific um, Sun Serum. This one's SPF 50 the new Mamonde Bacuchiol uh, Retinol Cream, the Iope um, Skin Softener, so I guess this is like an essence, and also the Amore Pacific um, Ample. This is from their um, Vintage Single Extract um, range. And then also because I spent so much, <laughs> I got 10 points worth of Deluxe Size Miniatures. So these, I'd say four were worth one point. The miniature of the Sulusu First Care Activating Serum was worth three points. And then I think these two were worth two points. Is that right? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, maybe not. Maybe this one was also one point actually. Um, and then the Hedda Biocell Essence, which I have used before and I really like. Um, <clears throat> that one was two points, but anyways, that's 10 uh, points worth of deluxe size miniatures. And then for my actual purchases, I got the mise en scene hair serum. I've used this before, the original one in the orange packaging, but this one is their rose one, and I just really like it, and it smells really good. Um, I got the Mamond uh, Skin Barrier Probiotics Ceramide Cream. This is the intense version. It's very lightweight. Actually, when I tried it, it looked like a gel-like consistency, and I was like, oh, this isn't going to be very nourishing on my skin, but um, it really does create a kind of layer of moisture to help retain um, hydration within the skin, so I did really like the consistency, and probiotics is something that's kind of trending a lot in skincare ranges at the moment. Um, I got this glowy foundation from Espoir. Oh, I didn't realize it actually contains a little bit of SPF as well, so that's an added bonus. Um, my friend Anna was raving about this, so um, she used to work uh, in social media for a skincare company, and she said whenever she had her <clears throat> makeup done, they would apply this one, and I um, swatched it at the Amore Song Suit, and I really liked it. Um, I also got a Hedda Matte Lip Tint. Um, I don't really need another lip tint, but this one was just such a pretty shade and I really like the applicator and the packaging. So that's that one. I might try that one tomorrow so that you can see it. And then finally, I got an SPF. So this is the new SPF from Monday. This is their Vitamin Sun Cream. SPF 50. Um, and yeah, I did look at their whole sun care range and this one, oh, there's, there's just a lot of tone up sun creams out at the moment. They seem to be like really trending, but I don't really like that effect. 
um, this one was nourishing but non-greasy at the same time so yeah I opted for that one so I just had a little FaceTime with Steve and kimchi and yeah I'm pretty tired now I think the antihistamines I've taken are like a little bit drowsy inducing because suddenly I was just like oh so I'm gonna call it a night it is nine o'clock hopefully I have a good sleep tonight I'm feeling confident and yes I am up early tomorrow morning to head to Gangnam for a day with someone very fun who I think you'll enjoy so I'll see you in tomorrow's vlog bye mm -hmm.